Why is there a camera on that corner? What is happening right here? I'm Chris Hansen. Chris Hansen at the Catch a Predator has become a staple in this channel and, and one that I've been happy to share with people. Get those awful people's faces spread around and the awareness that these people exist. And uh, they got a new show called Takedown with Chris Hansen. We watched it before. We had um, Glory Hold, Jerry, and oh, yeah. uh, Golf Cart Matt. Oh, no, no way. Your eyes are not. Bruh. <laughs> Golf yeah. cart Matt has arrived. Wow. <laughs> and he's got, got rims on that thing, bro. Yeah, yeah off-roading with this sucker. Jerry, how old did Travis you know say that? that he was in your conversation? <laughs> 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 Let me continue this interview while you're on your face. Dude's out there getting cuffed. Yeah, Jerry. So anyway, continue <laughs> on, Jerry. And a lot of people have been sending this latest one to me. Uh, it's called Ryan Wants to Bounce. And I don't know if that means he's he's like, a I need to go. I need to bounce. <laughs> I gotta or... leave right. Yeah. I really want to guard this bar. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and so, yeah, we'll take a look at that one today. But before we do, be sure to subscribe to Dane on Buff Pro on YouTube and Twitch. He's streaming on Twitch now. And then check out the Toasty Games channel if you want to see some live streams. And I guess Simon Toast Kid on Twitch as well. Check out this graph. Wow, amazing. You made that graph better by subscribing and being subscribed and watching this video and watching the whole video and watching the ads and doing all the things and being interactive with all the different things you got to do. Oh my God, it's just never ending, but do it. Thank you. <laughs> hey, leave a comment. Yeah, yeah, that's, yeah, yeah, please. Yeah, do all that stuff. Tell them I got pizza. <laughs> do we have any pizza left? Yeah, do we have any pizza left? Put yeah. it out here. Two slices. <laughs> Perfect. I'm in Marquette County, Michigan. Man. I'm one of the biggest. <laughs> it's very, very relaxed back there in the back room. There's like, <laughs> we got some pizza. <laughs> right, this guy's a pedophile, right? <laughs> <laughs> oh. That's how you know you're used to it. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's, like, yeah. that's depressing to think about. The chat begins on a popular social media site and starts off pretty casual, but it quickly turns salacious. Ryan sends very graphic oh photos. Good lord! The decoy like clearly states he's younger. But that's not dissuading oh. Ryan because he says he's on his way. <laughs> you know, he's like, you know what? Usually the youngest I go for is 18, but you're so hot. Oh, boy. Wow. Like, you know, usually. In most cases, which leads me to believe previously, there have been other cases where... All right. Oh, Lord. Come on. Good. How are you? Good. You just go ahead and sit down. Did you bring anything? That's some lube. Oh, the thing that gets me about this is that it almost looks like it's fake because the the production quality is so much higher than it used to be. Right, right, right for real. Like it, it almost looks like a skit now. The way everything's set up, and I can see a camera angles. from here. You know, I don't know if you like. There's a there's a, a whole lens right there. Very sneaky. But anyway, let's get back to the facts. So, homie here has showed up. He's got some lube in hand, ready to go. All right, well, I'm gonna go grab my bait. Okay. I left it upstairs. I'll be right back. Cool. Ryan gets comfortable, but I don't think he's going to be too comfy when I make an appearance. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. He's gonna see the camera. Don't look over there. Here he comes. Hey. Hey. How you doing? Good, how are you? <laughs> what are you up to tonight? Oh, uh, nothing much. Uh Okay. Oh, Ryan, oh Ryan. nothing. Oh, God, the panic. As oh. Chris Hansen walks out, he goes, oh, no. <laughs> I like, oh, I like no. how they got that stop sign right there. Stop. <laughs> yeah, stop. But how old are you? 26. 26. And what was your plan here tonight, Ryan? Um, I really don't know. You really don't know? No. I'm wondering if Ryan knows who he is or not. I mean, I'm assuming He's the people him. that are going out and I mean, it's like, Everybody knows what Chris Hansen is at this point, right? If you if you have a conversation about pedophilia, then you have like Chris Hansen pops in your head. You go, ah, he's gonna get you. Chris Hansen's coming after you. Like he's like the boogeyman for these people. Yeah, he is. And I figured that I would, you know, come and see and talk, right, and not do anything. <laughs> okay. Right. Right. That's why you brought the lube, so you're not gonna do anything. Yeah. Like, sort of talk uh, about all the lube I brought, you know, that's all. I just wanted to see and talk, you know, not do anything, of course, definitely not. But that's not what you indicated no. online. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You talk about bouncing on his... Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, he's like, when you say it, oh, God, it's so... This sounds terrible. Oh, yeah. Why would a 26-year-old man... Mm. 
bring Astroglide gel to meet a 15-year-old boy? Uh -oh. I think you do know. Right? I think you do know. I think That's, you yeah. do. <laughs> I think you know exactly what's going on here. But I wasn't going to do anything. More or less, I was thinking maybe he just needed it. He needed it for what? <laughs> so that he could masturbate himself. So he could masturbate himself. Yes. Oh, hey, hey, maybe, maybe a good save. No, no, <laughs> no, he's buying that, please. Wow. Well, so what were you going to do? Hang around and watch or something like like oh I just came to drop you off some lube see you later peace hey, man, just, yeah <laughs> like Uber Eats you know here you go man and what were you gonna do while he did that eat pizza no he didn't want to eat pizza he says yeah hungry. right he didn't want pizza you don't know no. I I don't know isn't a great answer Ryan because I don't I think didn't it's true realize that he was fifteen yes you did because he told you Ryan. <sighs> There's very few occasions where Chris Hansen actually like really goes at anyone. Like he he you know, like starts making fun of people. It's always like very just factual. It's like as horrible as the situation is, the whole entertaining of the whole thing is like just watching them squirm as it just repeats back to them what they said. Right, you know? right. Well, like they just struggle to like put the pieces. Like, how can I talk my way out of this? What can I do? How can I escape the situation? You can't. You can't. Nope. They got you. Hey, lie You're in the house. Trips. And I know it's wrong. You know it's wrong? Yes. What do you do for a living, Ryan? I work in a financial institution. A financial institution. In yes. which financial institution do you work at? I am not going to disclose that. You're not. <laughs> I am not telling you. Well, <laughs> I'm, I'm kind of starting to wonder if he does know who Chris Hansen is at this point. Yeah. I think that's where he's at in his head, too. He's like... So what's happening here? Like, am I? Yeah. Yeah, he's he's starting to realize, like, okay, I'm just digging this hole real deep. Yeah, well, he's getting next to the point where he's like, I'm going to leave. You know, I don't know who you are kind of thing. It's what it, uh, yeah, because if, if he knew this was Chris Hansen, then... <laughs> He just put his hands out like, cuff me, bro, I'm done. Yeah. Well, there's also like the camera nearby, too, that's moving around, too. Is that like someone standing in the room? Or I guess not. So yeah. people call up and they check their balances. And yeah. if there's fraud, you get involved. Correct. Have you ever been in trouble with the law before? No. Have you ever met anybody else online before? No. Well, he did say usually earlier, so I don't know. That's where I'm like, mm, I don't know, usually... Chris is over here using the using that conversation kung fu on him. Is like, so tell me, you know, your job, you do this. All right, so it's just, oh yeah, what do you do with credit cards? Yeah, nobody cares. What? So have you ever done this before? <laughs> do you see why that is difficult for me to believe? Yes. If you were me, would you believe it? No. Okay, so then why should I believe it? As I say, I'm very hard. Yeah, how do you, what do you even answer that? Because you got to believe me. All right, I was set up. It was Kevin. Kevin told me to come down here. And what are your folks going to think about all this? So I'm going to be in deep You're going to be in deep Yeah. And what's all this? Did you bring this or just the, the lube or what is all that? This is my phone and my keys. Live with the parents. Mm. Nothing wrong with living with the parents, but I mean, uh, I wonder if they will still be living with the parents. <laughs> Did you bring anything else in your car? No. Nope. Did you bring condoms? There might be condoms in my car. There might but be condoms in your car. There any <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Maybe but I, I didn't did, bring you know? them. What should happen to you? What's the fee? Hmm? Why is there a camera on that corner? Well. <laughs> <laughs> Cameraman's like, whoa, 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 whoops. <laughs> I was trying to get the mangles. There's a camera around that corner because I'm Chris Hansen. Dun, dun, dun. dun. <laughs> the music kicks in. <laughs> I'm Chris Hansen. Duh. <laughs> I'm Chris Hansen. <laughs> and then he covered his mouth like, oh, Chris Hansen? <laughs> oh, no. I do know this guy. I'm Chris Hansen. And we do stories on adults who try to meet children for Yeah, bring him in. Yeah. Put the camera in his Have face. Have you seen those stories before? Yes. Hey, what is that? The what is that? back here is disappointed. <laughs> <laughs> Even the TV's like, got him. I, you know, I, ho I hope that they they watch us react to these. And <laughs> because we kept talking about it, like, I miss the dudes that bring the camera into their face. We got these guys back out. I'll give myself, give, give ourselves credit, Dane. There you that. go. He's going to come in there and take a knee. Like, whoo! Yeah, like, he's going to blast him. <laughs> Why? A clue. A clue. What am I doing? Those are questions I have for you. <laughs> Why? <laughs> That's the, that's the first time I've heard that one. Why? 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 <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, I know that I did something wrong. I don't want to lose my job. And I'm, 
I'm very, very sorry for even what I did. I shouldn't have even came here. Why did you? I mean, help me to understand. I mean, it, 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 that's the thing about these situations, right? Is that if Chris Hansen wasn't here and it wasn't so, you know, right not only embarrassing. Attention. Right, exactly. Yeah. Like embarrassing and the, the the realization that you're in deep trouble. Would they even be like, I'm, I shouldn't have done this. This was wrong. I'm sorry. When the whole transcript's like, I am 15. And they're like, oh, I usually only go for 18. And then, 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 right, then, like right? it's a big joke. Like it's a big joke at the time, right? While he's typing it. It don't seem like a joke now. It's, it's <laughs> the same thing as like with, with a, I never know if it's the fact that they don't think it's wrong. Because like, you know, they're, their their own whatever whatever website they're using and they're horny you know they're like ah oh, well you know it's, you know whatever oh, having a good time yeah what's going on? yeah it's fine it's fine I didn't think nothing about it or if it's like deliberately like they they know it's wrong and they like doing it because it's wrong you know I, I don't ever know right, I always think it's, right. it's the the earlier one where it's like they just don't think it's a big deal because it's like a, a person is consenting even though they're underage and mm -hmm. so they just like kind of give themselves the pass and show up. That's what I always figured it is. They, they do the mental gymnastics themselves and until they think it's, mm -hmm. oh, well, yeah, maybe, maybe maybe this time it won't be, it's okay. Till they get yeah. here and they get tased. I wasn't thinking clear. You weren't thinking clear. Were you on drugs? No. Were you drinking? No. <laughs> Are you high? <laughs> <laughs> Are you wasted, bro? And there's nobody your age? I mean, there is. Do you have brothers and sisters? No, I'm an only child. You're an only child. So, hey, Chris, I'm not going to be banging my brothers and sisters, but what weird question, bro. That's a whole other crime. <laughs> it is. Did you have any second thoughts as you were driving over here? Yes, I did. Why did you come anyway? Hey, Shanta. That's the part right there. That's that what I was talking about earlier. I was like, they know, right? Yeah. Yeah, gotcha. Like, what if Chris Hansen's there? You know, that, that that shouldn't be the actual deterrent. The deterrent should be that this is wrong. This is wrong. Yeah. If I wasn't here and it was just you and this boy, what do you think would have happened? I probably would have talked to him and probably would have left. Doubt! <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Always say that. I would have been like, hey, here's some lube. See you. <laughs> right. And. And probably oh, on his no. <laughs> That's what I, <laughs> I probably want to. Those are your words, right? Am I making this up? No, you are not making it up. You're going to bring lube so he could bounce on your and you could bounce on his mm -hmm. That's what you said. Yes. That's not even in the gray area. No, it was in the text that I wrote. But I think after I would have gotten here, I would have figured out that this is not what I should be doing. <sighs> right, right, right. Nobody, nobody believes that. Doubt! You didn't seem nervous. You said you seemed like you were comfortable sitting on the couch waiting for him to go get his vape and then bounce on his c Chris just keeps saying it. <laughs> You're like throwing it back in this dude's face, man. I love it. But you sure had the lube for it. <laughs> How long was the drive over here? 20 minutes. 20 minutes. And during that entire 20 minutes, did you ever say to yourself, Ryan, you're going to see a 15 year old kid. This is wrong, it's illegal. Yes. What made you come anyway? Uh, according to the text, it's because he was so hot. And that's why he said he oh, made the yeah. exception to begin with. You're yeah. right. Yeah. Too, too hot. hot. And now I'm thinking, why did I? I'm trying to figure out why I did anyway. I know I did wrong. I'll admit I did wrong. And I will take the, you know, the consequence of it. But I just don't want to be losing my job. Oh, well, that is... Oh, that's part of the, the consequences. That's, that's part of the consequences. <laughs> yeah, going to jail and all that. You're probably not going to have your job. What do you say to other people on these social media platforms tonight who are talking to underage teens about s That you should verify who you're speaking with. And what's your biggest regret about this evening? That I did not verify that. What? Now it's there. Uh, now it's yeah. the kid's fault. Or his, I, 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 dude, I'm, um. The lack of verification now? I didn't know it was Chris Hansen. You make sure it's not Chris Hansen before you go, guys, okay? That's my message for everyone else out there. <sighs>
when they when you ask how old they are and they tell you and you say eh, whatever you know you're hot make sure you verify what a oof so you were going to break the law because this boy was hot you were going to take know. advantage of somebody who was vulnerable naive and underage and i know i shouldn't be i shouldn't that's you know i know Woo! Yeah. ow it's uh it's impressive how you get a lot of these guys that go in here like, nope, nope, didn't, you know, blah, 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 you know, avoid everything. And like the, the interview is very, I guess, weak, I guess. Right. Yeah. But this guy's sitting here and he's like, yep, I did wrong. And he's like admitting to it and everything. And, and Chris is just like, we going in. <laughs> you are, you are a piece of trash. That me saying you're a piece of trash. Do you have a college education? Yes. Where'd you go to school? Northern. Northern. Right here in Marquette. Mm hmm And you, what did you study? Uh, business. Business. All right. And I'm actually going to be going and getting my master's degree. You're going to get your master's? Yep. No, I'm kicking my ass because. A lot of plans for, you know, there's still the whole legal proceeding that's coming that you got <laughs> to consider here. But uh, yeah, yeah, w w eventually. I didn't think. With all of this. I did not think. All right. Well, Ryan, there's some people here who want to talk to you. Okay. You want to stand up? No. Yeah. The police. We want to talk to you. Is that a bong? Oh my god, it is. <laughs> it's on chair. Was that there the whole time? <laughs> <laughs> got that freaking Arnold Schwarzenegger on the wall. Hey. Jesus over here. He's disappointed. <laughs> who, who decorated this place? Pizza and bong. Am I going to jail? Yes, you are. You're under arrest. Dun dun dun. <laughs> Yeah. Yep. That master's gonna have to wait, buddy. It always amazes me how somebody can live a normal life, be well educated, and have a good job in the daytime, and be engaging in this sort of activity at night. That's Ryan. <laughs> Got another one. All right. Yep. Ryan was charged with four felonies: accosting a child for immoral purposes, child abusive activity and two counts of using a computer to commit a crime he was released on a personal recognizance bond as he awaits his day in court personal recon i don't even know what that word is fancy <laughs> they've also started putting all suspects presumed innocent until proven guilty so i think i guess they're going to have to go through all the legal things of like if someone shows up and they're on the show and that somehow they are released later on and you know they're proven innocent somehow are not proven is that they're not proven guilty somehow them appearing doesn't like ruin them forever anyway which right. it will right, right? <laughs> yeah i mean yeah just don't do creepy awful stuff like this whoa you blow my mind right now that's a, that's a crazy idea bro <laughs> man anyway that is uh has been that episode of takedown with chris hansen <laughs> ryan wants to bounce all right that's it for this episode hope you guys enjoyed it leave a like leave a comment do all that cool stuff if today's your birthday happy birthday stay toast my friends we'll see you next time Bye bye